Okay, so in previous videos it was explaining very, uh, at a very high pace, it was just trying to explain very quickly what goes into info.dat. Info.dat is one of those files which are uh, the, just the standard name for a file containing the list of, uh, of images and the list of coordinates of the objects and the images. Uh, in this case it's mostly the positives, meaning actually objects of meaning, not just random stuff. So uh, what we'll actually want to use later is examples of things which are not positive, which is just basically random noise, because we do have to provide this to a classifier uh, with which to build upon. Uh, so what I'm going to try and show you now is how we actually use the tool, which use uh, uh, info.dat. So info.dat is, as I explained before, that's the input file for a uh, for you know the, the tool which we're going to use later, and it's create samples. I'm going, just going to put a very common command here to show before. Open CV create samples minus uh, minus or dash whatever you want to call it. Uh, vec vec uh, dash info info that that. Uh, info that that is the file might have some different uh, paths somewhere wherever it's located you can change the name of the file if you want to save it to something else in my case I have one info dot that file for a single car because sometimes I want to build a classifier specific to one car uh, and vec is going to be just the uh, I'm going to try and see if it, it runs now just to give you an example yes it does uh, so vec is, is going to be the output file and the output file is, is a kind of a, uh, an, an, uh, it's actually an accumulation of several images which come from info.dat and that's going to be used later for training. And this is what comes out as the output, uh, created uh, 38 samples. Uh, for some reason I get past error at every time it gets, gets to the end of the file but it actually does things correctly. Uh, up until that point. Mm -hmm. uh, so by the time I get to the end of the file it basically produces this file called uh, if you go uh, ls uh, say back everything you'll see I've got a file called vac here and that's a file I'm going to use just in a moment I'll show you in the next part what to actually do with it 